Emily here from NYC Guitar School and today I'm walking you through how to play Kyoto by Phoebe Bridgers. Let's get into it. So this is Kyoto, Phoebe Bridgers. We have a capo here on the fourth fret. So I'm just placing that capo fourth fret. I'm playing with an acoustic today. Uh, this, is, this song is in 4-4. Four, four. So let's talk about some of these chords. So our intro, we've got a G chord here. Now this looks like an intimidating chord. Keep your pinky where it is, keep finger two where it is, that middle finger. Finger three, the ring finger is gonna stretch up to that fifth string, third fret. The pinky lays down on string one, fret three. And then our first finger stretches all the way up to that second string, first fret. We get this really cool C sus2 with a G in our bass note. So what we're gonna have there is G two three four C sus two three four G two three four C sus two three four. One other thing you can do is you could play your G the same exact way but with fingers two three four. So here's my hand, finger two, three, four, playing that G, to where then all I have to do is keep my pinky where it is, move finger three down a string, finger two up to string six, and then finger one lays down. I really like that transition, it just feels a little smoother, as an option. So we're going to have two full measures. G, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, C, sus, two, three, four, C, sus, two, three, again. And G, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, C, sus, two, three, four, C, sus. Day off in Kyoto, got bored at the temple, looked round at the 7-Eleven. The band took the speed train, went to the arcade, I wanted to go, but I didn't. Call me from a payphone, they still got payphones, it costs a dollar a minute. Tell me you're getting sober, you wrote me a letter, but I don't have to read it. And that's our verse, so each chord just gets repeated twice full measure of each chord. All right, our chorus is super fun. So here are our chords. We've got A minor. So bass note is that A, fifth string. Keep finger one and two right where it is. Finger three stretches up to that sixth string, third fret. The pinky lays down on that fifth string, third fret. C over G, so it's a C chord with a G on that sixth string in the bass note. We've got just a slash chord C over G there. And then we just move to our regular G. So A minor. I'm gonna kill you. And those are all full measures. A minor, two, three, four, C over G, three, four, G, two, three, four. We're gonna have a D over F sharp. So all you're gonna do is you're gonna play your, your open D and then stretch that thumb up to that second fret sixth string. So we've got just a regular D chord, stretch that thumb up. And that's sort of a simplified way um, to play what is written on this ultimate guitar chart. Um, I just play mine like a regular D with my finger, my thumb up on that second fret six string. Right, so A minor, C over G and G, D over F sharp, A minor, C over G. We've got E minor seven, which is one of my favorite chords. It's pretty simple, one finger, just that fifth string second fret everything else is open. Through Tokyo skies, back to D over F sharp. A minor, C over G and G, D over F sharp. A minor, C over G and G. One more chord here, 
E minor six. So it's similar to our E minor, but we're just adding in a sixth pitch there. So finger one is on that fourth string, second fret, and then the pinky stretches up to the fifth string, fourth fret. Everything else is open. I love the sound of this chord, super, super fun. And then we end with a C over G. All right, so that chorus, everything is a full measure except for the C over G at the end. We have just an extra C over G. We, we stay there for just an extra measure. So from the top, from that A minor, I'm gonna kill you if you don't beat me to it. Dreaming through Tokyo skies. I wanted to see the world. Then I flew over the ocean. Instrumental. G two three four G two three four C sus two three four C sus two three again and G two three four G two three four C sus two three four C sus two three four. Here's that C sus again. Now we get into our next verse, which is very similar. We've got a G again. G to our C sus again. Two, three, four, two, three, four, and G, two, three, four, G, two, three, four, C sus, two, three, four, two, three, four, G, two, three, four. We have a little change here. One measure of G, we move to our G over F sharp. So we end it here on this G. All we're gonna do is leave that third finger there, bring fingers one and two up, second fret strings six and five. So our bass note is just changing from a G, G, to an F sharp, bum. That's it, we're just changing the bass note. We have one more C sus. G, G over F sharp, C sus. Right, and that's that second verse. So similar, but we do bring in that G over F sharp. Sunset's been a freak show on a weekend, so I've been driving out to the suburbs to park at the Goodwill and stare at the chemtrails with my little brother. Said you called on his birthday, you were off by like 10 days, but you get a few points for trying. Remember getting the truck fixed when you let us drive it. 25 felt like flying. We have another chorus that is very similar. Everything is the same except for we add this very long sounding chord. Let's just call it D add four for now. It's just the third fret on the second string and your bass note is A, that fifth string. So that little three FR just means third fret, second string. I don't forgive you, but please don't let me hold it. Born on the Scorpio skies, I wanted to see the world through your eyes until it happened. So just one chord change there, third fret, second string. Now we just have an outro. All right, here's our outro. We've got guess a lie, C over G, I'm alive, one more. And we 
just end on C over G. And those are all of our chords. And that's the basic premise of the song. Uh, intro to a verse, to a chorus, to an instrumental, to a verse, to a chorus, and an outro. Now, one last thing that you can do to sort of make this song sound fun is we can play what we at the guitar school call the best drum. So we have down, down, up, up, down, up. So that's just one and two and rest on three and four and. So we'd have down, down, up, up, down, in Kyoto, got bored at the temple, looked around at the 7-Eleven, the band took the speed train, I went to the arcade, I wanted to go but I didn't, called me from a pay phone, they still got pay phones, it costs a dollar a minute, to tell me you're getting sober. going into our chorus and I'm gonna kill you if you don't beat me to it dreaming through Tokyo skies I wanted to see the world then I flew over the Instrumental and one and two three four G two three four C sus two three four C sus two three four and G two three four G two three four C sus two three four sus first two freak show on a weekend so I've been driving out to the suburbs to park at the on that C over G. And there you have it. That is Kyoto by Phoebe Bridgers. I will link the chart in the description below. Let me know how it goes. And if you have any other Phoebe Bridgers requests or tutorial requests, just let me know. I would love to make one for you. Thanks for stopping by. Have a great day.